All right, this is in reference to adding more swatches to Flexi. Uh, a lot of people know this, some people don't. Uh, it took me a couple times before I figured it out. So here, let's start all over. The way I do it is uh, you would right click your transparent box. You would do new table. So now we got an empty table. You're gonna double click that. You go over here and you wanna select your new table. It's empty, library. All right, there are thousands and thousands of colors in here. I can't remember. There's so many good ones that I've found just digging through here. Uh, one that works. Let's see one that works. Uh, anyways, let's just get to it. Here's a Pantone swatch. Metallic, pastel. I mean, it's just the number of colors is ridiculous. Mamaki swatch. Uh one that uh, a lot of graphics people like to use is the Oracle, uh 651. So basically, I'm just going to hold down Shift, grab all these, and I'm going to add them. Okay, and now I have all my Oracle 651 colors. These should, or I'm, I'm not going to say should, they will match up somewhat close to the actual vinyl. Um, you know, you got your default red or NorCal red. I don't know uh, if it throws color codes or not, but yeah, there's a uh, there's plenty of swatches in there. There's some really good ones. Um, just gonna look for one more real quick. If I could find this one that I've used before, I really liked it. I think it's this LG Chem. Yeah, this one's nice. I just like the the gamma. This one's pretty cool. I mean, there's just tons. Have fun. Appreciate y'all watching. And uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, subscribe on YouTube, Flexi Plugins. Thank you.